Ethiopia on Thursday began generating electricity from the second turbine of the controversial Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam despite fierce objections from Egypt and Sudan. The second turbine, also known as Unit 9, is capable of generating 375 megawatts of electricity. The inauguration of Unit 9 comes more than five months after Ethiopia began power generation from the first turbine, following which Egyptian authorities condemned Addis Ababa's decision to start producing power without consulting Cairo and Khartoum. Egypt called Ethiopia's move a violation of the 2015 Declaration of Principles signed by all three countries. The DOP, which outlines 10 principles, calls on Addis Ababa to inform both Cairo and Khartoum before undertaking any operations regarding GERD. Egypt has also condemned Ethiopia for starting the third filling of the Nile Dam, and sent a letter to the United Nations Security Council in July objecting to the move. However, Ethiopian Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed insists that the construction of GERD will not harm Egypt or Sudan. Ethiopia claims it has completed 88% of the dam's construction work and the project will be fully ready by the end of 2023, at which point it will become Africa's largest hydropower project, with a total capacity of 5.15 gigawatts. Authorities have said the dam will bring light to 60% of the population and provide energy security to vulnerable sections. Egypt relies on the Nile River for 96% of its freshwater needs, and 85% of the river's water flow is provided by the Blue Nile tributary, which originates in Ethiopia. It thus fears that the dam will decrease its supply of Nile water.